Let's add some scrolling text to your video, all right? Okay, so we have shortcut turned on. We put in a clip. We put the clip into the timeline. And this is non-negotiable. Create a new video track. If you don't create a new video track, if you think, oh, we can probably go ahead and just use one video track, leave this video. Get out of here. Sorry, I'm stressed. This HTML editor we're about to use is so annoying. Anyways, let's go to file and open other and go to color and just use the default transparent. Press OK, and now this black thing is a transparent thing. Drag this transparent thing. It's a clip. Just drag it here. You know what? Let's just stretch it to 10 seconds. Next step, while transparent is selected, not cake, select transparent and press a plus and press uh, video and search for HTML or TEXT. Pick the text HTML filter. Now pick simple scroll. Okay, now pick a folder. I already picked one. And just press OK after you enter the folder. Okay, now it created the file simple underscore scroll dot HTML. And here you can paste your credits. So I hope that you have your credits ready. Just copy them and paste them. And here they are. And uh, I'm gonna do the following. I'm gonna center them, align center. And I'm gonna change the color because I want them to be white format. While they are all selected, I selected it all using Control A. You can also go to Edit, Select All, Format, Font, Text Color, not Font Color, and just click White or mix something on your own. OK, OK. Don't think this is over. We're going to have to get back to this title editor. Don't worry. For now, save and close if you want. OK, let's take a look. Uh, playback, and you can see directed by. Oh! and it's cut off. So there's multiple solutions. We're going to start by editing the HTML code. Go to view source. Scroll down. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't be scared. All right. Over here by style, just after body and after the squiggly opening parentheses, just write space width uh, colon space 100% semicolon and just press save and then click on the video editor click here and you can see it's centered but let's play back looking good looking good so oh oh it's cut off again you have two solutions which are okay you can either hand edit this by going to edit uh, going to w uh, y s i w y g uh, what you see is what you get editor and scroll down to the problematic area and just i don't know enter here and enter here and remember to save and then you can check it so maybe this is fine maybe you like the solution but if you don't like the solution then uh, let me just undo this delete that delete that if you want it to happen automatically then just go back to view source scroll down again and over here we have a uh, body style text wait a second what Okay, so we can see white space no wrap is all over the place. There's no search function here, so we have to just uh, just assume. I guess you're gonna have to just copy this whole block and then pray you have a decent text editor, like for example, Notepad++, paste the whole text, use the search and replace function. We're gonna replace uh, white space no wrap over here and one white space in front of that. We're gonna replace that with absolutely nothing. So let's select, uh, replace that all in, not in all open files, or yeah, that would be crazy. Just replace all. Okay, so now we're gonna just select everything, copy it, click here and control V and press save and hope for the best. Okay, so now it's auto wrapping, which is disgusting. So you probably don't want this. You probably want to manually fix that. Another thing you can do is go back to the editor, uh, go back to the what you see is what you get, select everything and go to format, font, size, change it to 32, I guess. Yuck. Save. Take a look. Maybe this is fine. And now let's go nuts. Go to the what you see is what you get editor, select everything, go to format and get some text shadow. I guess free, free, free. And save. And it crashes. Good thing I made this video where I explain how to recover crashed projects.
Oh, it actually remembered the autosave. Okay, cool. Well, let's see if it crashes. Hey, it works! Nice. This looks actually pretty good. Pick these solutions. I really hope you have a text editor ready. If not, I recommend Notepad++. You can get portable versions as well. And enjoy your credits or whatever text you are scrolling in your video. I think this is a bit simpler than the last solution I showed you. Have fun. Until next time. Ciao.